some things in FM24 are a little bit strange. As an example, we are not playing in the English Premier League, but playing in the English Premier Division. We have a team here called Man UFC, and yes, back in his days, Roy Keane probably was into some UFC fighting on the pitch, but they are definitely not uh, named Man UFC. And a national team like Germany is missing their actually real players. And all of this comes down to licensing issues. This video will show you how to fix it. And we're going to take a look at both PC, Mac, Xbox, Steam, Epic Games, Game Pass and Steam Deck. And uh, what we need to do is to download a licensing fix. And there are, are a couple of web pages that provides those. And I'm going to take you step by step on how to install it. So the first thing we need to do, and I've shown you it on PC now, but I'm still going to show you where you find the equivalent folders on, on other devices. You need to find a folder where you install FM24. And uh, that can depend, because when you are installing the game, you get a few options. You can uh, install it in uh, different drives. But this is the default way. So I'm going to see colon program 86, and I find the Steam folder, the uh, Steam apps, the common, the FM24, data, database, DB, and the 2400 folder. And in this folder, I'm going to delete these three ones. And here we have the location for those folders on both Steam, Epic Games, Game Pass, Steam Deck, and also Xbox Game Pass. And shout out to Sorted Out FM, all these folder locations I got from their webpage, and it's going to be a link to their webpage in the description below. And here are the equivalent folders for Mac, both for the normal version and the FM Touch 24 version. And uh, there are some special things on Mac where the folder can be hidden. I'm going to put links in the description below to how you can find those hidden folders. In this folder, we're going to delete these three folders. And I also have downloaded a fix here, and I'm going to put a link to it in the description below. And we need to extract it because it comes as a compressed folder. And if you right click it, there should be an, an uh, option on how to do that. So I'm going to go in this folder and here we have the three folders that we just deleted, but of course the fixed versions. I'm going to put them inside the 2400 folder instead. Now we have the new ones. I can delete my fixed files here. And uh, this is all that we need to do for now. The challenge is that this may not apply to current ongoing saves. You may have to start a new save for the fix to apply. And also, Sometimes when the games get updated, you might need to reapply this one for, for new saves. And now that the fix have been applied, we see we have no longer Man UFC. We actually have Man United. Of course, other names might have changed. We are playing in the Premier League, not the Premier Division. And teams like the German national team now have a real actual players in them. And there are two more important things before we end this video. First off, these fixes will be updated. I'm recording this as uh, just after the beta got released and probably through the next couple of few weeks, they're going to be updated and improved on. So you might want to download them again if you download them early on. And another thing is that in a few weeks, the game's creators will publish a free editor for this game. And whenever that one is released, they usually use that editor to improve on these fixes. With, the, with database updates. If those has been released, these are the folders where you're going to apply the database files if uh, those are included when you download them. But for PC, it's basically documents, sports interactive, football manager, editor data. And as you can see, we have the equivalent folder for the Mac. So if uh, there are databases files uh, attached, these are the locations where you're going to put them. And when you start a new save, you can choose to add those custom database files. So they won't affect achievements or anything like that. And uh, if uh, you found this guide helpful, make sure to press that like button because that uh, helps me out. And uh, if you're struggling with this, let me know in the comments section below and I will, to the best of my ability, try to help you out. And of course, if this one is working for you, also share that in the comments section below so other people can see that it's actually working.